Alright, against the odds, playing some harmless pack in standard. We'll play first, and I guess this is okay. A bit land heavy. So, Evolving Wilds, go. Opponent has a Meandering River. Interesting. Well, Crack Evolving Wilds, get a Mountain. <laughs> More land. Swamp, go. Oi! We do not want to keep drawing lands. Another meandering river for our opponent. Oh boy. Wandering Fumeral. Go. Maybe we should have just mulliganed. Island for our opponent. And passes. Valving Wilds. Go. Oh, that's three lands in a row. And here comes the Spirits. Plains for our opponent. Gets in four, two. Alright, crack of Valving Wilds. Get a island, I guess. Oh my lord. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Well, let's get our Obnix list countered. Oh, uh, resolves. All right, so let's draw a card. Well, at least it is not a land. <laughs> oh, so many lands. Selfless Spirit with Flash. Oh, God. Rattle Chains. Uh, that's kind of bad news. That means Obnix list is just going to die. And we're not especially close to doing anything good. So our opponent gets in for six, passes. Another land. Uh, I guess we just pass for now. Taking an extra turn doesn't really do anything. Opponent's probably got spell quellers. Gets in with everything. Down to 11. And passes. Now Sunken Hollow. All right, let's pass the turn. See if we can get lucky. Yeah, we're just pretty dead. Mausoleum Wanderer. I guess our hope is to draw Languish, maybe. Tap land for our opponent. Gets in with everything. Down to four. We draw another land. Well, let's cast part the water veil. And Clash of Wills. All right. I mean, I guess we bring in Languishes and Grasp of Darkness. Go down a couple Summary Dismissals, a Dark Petition, and, an, and the Odd Nixless, I guess. And maybe we go down part the water veil. Try it like that. All right. We get to play first, and hey, this is somewhat reasonable-ish. Wandering Fumeral, go. Tap land for our opponent. Well, Swamp and Hedron Crawler. Pass the turn. Another Meandering River for our opponent, and Mausoleum Wanderer. Well, Sunken Hollow, go. That would have been a nice turn for our Demonic pack. The longer we wait, the easier it is for our opponent to counter it with something. Upkeeps a Nibble Ghast Herald. All right. We draw a Swamp. All right, we'll play Reveal a Swamp. Pass the turn. Opponent gets in four, three. Down to 16. And passes. <laughs> Plays an Elder Deep Fiend to tap our lands. All right, let's float two mana. And then just bounce the Elder Deep Fiend. Play a tap land. Pass the turn. Land for our opponent. Selfless Spirit. Pumps up Mausoleum Wanderer. Gets in 4-2. We're down to 14. And passes. Now let's play the Swamp and just languish. <laughs> and our opponent has Invasive Surgery and a Rattle Chains. Oh my god. Gets in with everything. Puts us down to 9. I mean, it really doesn't matter here. Because even if we take an extra turn, they can still emerge an Elder Deep Fiend. Obnixilis, uh, kill the Selfless Spirit. If we draw, we're just literally dead to Elder Deep Fiend. Opponent's going to emerge the Elder Deep Fiend. So this way, we're just dead to a Spirit. Alright, pass the turn. This match has not gone very well at all. Opponent swings with everything. Down to three. We draw another land. Part the Water Veil. And our opponent has a negate. All right, well, our opponent had a lot of ridiculous disruption. Yikes. All right, against the odds, playing some harmless pack in standard. And I guess we can keep this. We have many Jaces, which will hopefully find us our combo pieces. Well, Evolving Wilds, go. Canopy Vista. All right, let's crack this, get a Swamp. Sunken Hollow, go. Opponent. Ooh, all right, Needle Spire, so this is Naya? Well, let's Jace. We do not have a land, unfortunately. Pass the turn. Hangerback, X1. 
That's fine. And a tap land. Yeah, let's just play land, no reveal, pass the turn. Please in Evolving Wilds. And passes. Alright, let's loot with Jace. Discard a Jace. Evolving Wilds. And pass the turn. Cracks Evolving Wilds. Gets a Forest. Counter on the Hangerback. And Nahiri, eh? Alright. That's annoying. Gets to loot with Nahiri. We do have Slumgar's command, though. And passes. Well, let's Evolving Wilds. Get a Mountain. Loot with Jace. Ooh, and that's Demonic Pack, too. Well, we gotta get rid of the Nahiri first. Guess we discard the Jace. Sunken Hollow. And let's just pass the turn. Yeah, I think that's fine. Might be able to counter a another Planeswalker. Loots with Nahiri. Oh, this is the Heroic Naya deck. Plays a Tireless Tracker. Alright, that's actually fine. This might actually be better. So, in response, we get to kill Tireless Tracker and Nahiri, that's pretty sweet. <laughs> nice. Our opponent does get a clue, but opponent goes attacking. Well, we block with Jace, flip Jace. All right, opponent is Dromoka's command. Can't do much about that. Discard a, I guess just Sunken Hollow. And then let's Demonic Pack. Sunken Hollow, pass the turn, hope our opponent does not have another Nahiri in hand. I think they only play one in their deck if this is a Pro Tour deck. Dromoka's Command, more Dromoka's Command is also a problem. Nissa gets a land. Alright, plays the Forest. Plays a Sylvan Advocate. Alright, let's kill the Nissa, I think. Puts counter on the hanger back. Well, we will make our opponent discard their last two cards. <laughs> Archangel Avacyn and Dragonlord Atarka. Uh, Alright, so can we win here? If we draw another Part the Water Veil. So let's Part the Water Veil. Take an extra turn. Play Smoldering Marsh. Go to our second turn. This time we'll draw two cards. Part the Water Veil? No. But we get to Obnixilis. Kill Sylvan Advocate. Play Hedron Crawler. And Wandering Fumeral. Pass the turn. So our opponent has one turn to draw Dromoka's Command or Nahiri. Cracks the clue, they get an extra shot at it. Can they find one of those two cards? Cinder Glade, one card left, and it is... Activate Needle Spires, all right? <laughs> we got there. Our opponent is going to do some attacking at our Obnixilis. We let it go. We do not especially care. Uh, we untap. We kill Hanger Backwalker. Then being a nice opponent, oh man, <laughs> how trolly are we? We could give them our Hedron Crawler first. Uh, we'll be nice. Give our opponent the Demonic back. <laughs> and that does it! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, it's so sweet. Uh, Legendary Naya. I think we want Transgress the Mind against this deck. They're playing a lot of big things. And maybe another Languish? Going down... Well, Summary Dismissal is actually not bad. Let's go down a Summary Dismissal, a Part the Water Veil, a Dark Petition, and a couple of Hedron Crawlers, and try it like that. Uh, alright, we got a pack and two Summary Dismissals. Smoldering Marsh, go. Battlefield Forge for our opponent. Well, let's Estuary, Revealing Sunken Hollow, and Jace it. Pass the turn. Opponent has a Thalia. Okay. Um, let's loot with Jace. Getting Smoldering Marsh. So pitch a Smoldering Marsh. Play a Sunken Hollow. Pass the turn. Opponent gets in for 3, down to 17, and a Tireless Tracker. And the land. Evolving Wilds. Oh boy. Uh, maybe we should be playing more languishes. Fumeral. Well, loot with Jace. Get a Blighted Fen. Oh, this is so slow. Well, discard Wandering Fumeral. Or Evolving Wilds. Play Wandering Fumeral. Pass the turn. Opponent cracks Evolving Wilds. Gets a Plains. Another land for our opponent. Gets a Clue. Gets in 4-6. Down to 11. 
and passes. We get a harmless offering. We can't flip our Jace yet. It probably means Avacyn, which I guess means play a land and just pass the turn. Opponent cracks the clue. Cracks the clue. Yeah, we're very dead. Another land, another clue. Declaration Stone. Well, let's loot with Jace. And yeah, that does it. Huh. All right. So this is different than I imagined. More aggressive than I imagined. So bring in one more Languish. Also bring in the Grasp. Go down the rest of the Hedron Crawlers. Try it like that. All right, we get to play first. Ugh. Well, we can't keep that. All right, this is pretty awful, but we'll try it. Valving Wilds Goo. Canopy Vista for our opponent. Well, crack Evolving Wilds, get our melon. Uh, let's just swamp and transgress the mind. Sigarda, Atarka, Dramoka's Command, and Hangerback. Um, I guess we just take Sigarda. Pass the turn. Tap land for our opponent. We get another summary dismissal. Well, Evolving Wilds go. There's Hangerback, X1. Well, let's crack Evolving Wilds, get an island. Uh, play an island, pass the turn. Tap land for our opponent. And passes. <laughs> oh, that is a lot of summary dismissals. Ticks up hanger back, draws another land, and passes. We get a dark petition that we cannot cast yet. Ticks up hanger back, opponent passes. Alright, there's a valving wild, so we're getting closer to being able to dark petition. Opponent gets in 4-4, four, four, plays Fortified Village. All right, crack Evolving Wilds, get a Swamp, and pa untap. Oh, another harmless offering. We know our opponent has Dramoka's Command. We're in danger of losing to this hanger back. I think we just got to pass. Opponent gets in with hanger back, down to 12. Evolving Wilds cracks it. All right, we could stifle it, but... Gets a forest and passes. Yeah, I guess we should have just done that. Well, there's summary dismissal to turn on spell mastery. Feels pretty bad, but I don't think we really have a choice. Sunken Hollow, Dark Petition. And let's get Oath of Jace. Cast Oath of Jace. Draw some cards. Discard a couple cards. And transgress the mind. Thalia's Lancers and Dragonlord Atarka. Two Dramoka's Commands and Declaration in Stone. Well, we gotta take Lancers and just hope our opponent does not draw land here. If they draw land, we're essentially just dead. They're going to Dramoka's Command, get rid of our Oath of Jace. Alright, no land. That's a good sign. We take five, down to seven. Oh, tap land. Alright. Well, they have a Tarka for next turn. But we get to play a Jace, play a Wandering Fumeral, pass the turn. Opponent's going to Declaration in Stone our Jace. Okay. We get a clue. Goes attacking. Well, let's crack our clue. Get a land. Drop to two. And we are pretty dead here. Another Harmless Offering. And... Oh, I think that does it. Yep. That does it. <laughs> Alright, against the odds time. Offering our opponent a deal with the devil. Evolving Wilds, goo. Please not Benton Company. Ooh, the red-green deck. All right, or <laughs> the blue-red deck. Crack this, get a mountain. Uh, I think they have counters, which could be sketchy. Let's Estuary, reveal a Sunken Hollow. And Jay's number one, pass the turn. There's a Fiery Impulse and a Tap Land. Well, Jay's number two and a Sunken Hollow. Pass the turn. Mountain for our opponent. And another Fiery Impulse. And take Inventory. Well, Hedron Crawler, Smoldering Marsh, pass the turn. Opponent passes. Well, how about Jace number three? Sunken Hollow, pass the turn. One of these days, we're going to actually loot with Jace, but it is not today. Another tap land for our opponent. Oh my goodness, all harmless offerings, no demonic packs. Island for our opponent, and a Thermo Alchemist. Well, if there's one thing I've learned this week, it's you got to kill Thermo Alchemist. Card is... Too good. Come on, action. Valving Wild, pass the turn. Opponent. I kind of want them to play a Fevered Visions, because I really would like to draw some cards. Ah, oh, thank you, opponent. Fevered Visions for our opponent. Opponent draws. We crack a Valving Wilds, get a... Eh, I guess Island's fine. Wandering Fumeral, pass the turn. Draw. 
more lands. So many lands. We've drawn all Jace's lands and harmless offerings. Another Fevered Visions. Yikes. Well, we will see how this goes. We're going to have to actually draw some action here. Ooh, Obnixilis is sort of action. So let's Obnixilis. Gets hit by Unsubstantiate. Smoldering Marsh. Oh, are we just going to die to Fevered Visions? Pass the turn. Draw Slumgar's Command in a Disperse. Another Fevered Visions. Oh my lord. Well, let's Disperse of Fevered Visions. <laughs> Our opponent must have a counter because they're not replaying it. Ooh, Summary Dismissal. Well, let's Obnixilis. Oh, this feels so bad, but we're going to draw a card. Sunken Hollow. And I guess we just pass. They're going to shoot down our Obnix list. We get another Summary Dismissal. All right. Let's counter and bounce. Or attempt to. Opponent bounces our Slumgar's command. Okay. Draws a million cards. Has to discard. We draw a land. Now let's draw with Obnix list. Another land. Play a land. Well, I guess we just gotta pass and see what happens. We could Summary Dismissal to counter all these triggers. Alright. Well, we would have taken a ton of damage, so I think we had to do that. Fiery Impulse. Uh, yeah, we don't really need that mana. Thing in the Ice. Okay. Exquisite Firecraft. Well, let's Summary Dismissal. And opponent has another unsubstantiate. So many unsubstantiates. All right, well, we take four. Down to eight. Opponent draws three. We get a dark petition. Well, that's dark petition. What is our way out of here? Because I think if we get demonic pack, we just lose. So let's get part the water fail. Play a smoldering marsh. Awaken part the water fail. Kill thing in the ice. Man, if we win from this position, that would be so insane. It's not impossible. We're going to need to run well, but it could happen. We draw a Grasp of Darkness, a Sunken Hollow, and a Swamp. Oh, uh, well, discard a Swamp. We get a Summary Dismissal. Well, we draw with Obnixilis. There's a part of the Water Veil. We're going to do it. Are we going to do it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We might do it. Oh, this is going to be so ridiculous. Oh, so that means we just have to natural part the water veil. Get in for six. And then summary dismissal. Oh, and our draw is Hedron Crawler. Oh, we were so close. Oh, my goodness. Well... We got lots of stuff to bring in, which is good. Negates, Duress, Transgress, Going Down, Languish, Obnixilis, Hedron Crawlers, Go down to two part the Water Veils, and go down a Painful Truce. Try it like that. Actually, let's go down on Jace, because it's just going to die. Alright, let's try it like that. Alright, we get to play first. I guess we keep. This hand isn't exciting. Alright, Evolving Wilds, go. Wandering Fume roll for our opponent. Crack Evolving Wilds, get a mountain. Estuary, reveal the island, pass the turn. Island for our opponent. And Thermo Alchemist. Now, uh, Smoldering Marsh, pass the turn. Mountain for our opponent. And there's the Fevered Visions. Well, the only good news is we get to untap island and cast a demonic pack. Opponent pings us for one. We draw a part the water veil. Interesting. Well, if our opponent ever taps out, I think we are just going to try to give them the pack. Another Thermo Alchemist. And another Thermo Alchemist. Jeez. All right, opponent draws. We need to just shoot down a Thermo Alchemist. Blighted Fen. Now, well, Smoldering Marsh. The question is, can we wait and risk things going wrong? Yeah, let's pass. Let's wait one more turn. Ooh, Transgress is somewhat helpful. At least we can see what's in our opponent's hand. All right, let's let it go. Opponent pings us for one. Pings us for one. Take inventory to untap. All right, let's bounce Fevered Visions, kill an Alchemist. Opponent gets to draw a card. Tap land. Pings us. Oh, we get the combo kill. 
<laughs> we got him! <laughs> yes! Alright, opponent puts this to 14. The problem is, we get to draw two cards. Then we... Oh, we got the uber combo. We even have a negate for backup. Then we just part the water veil to take an extra turn. Get another choice with our pack. Then we do target opponent discards two cards. <laughs> yes! Oh, the extra turn to not let our opponent untap. And then we simply harmless offering the pact over to our opponent. Combo kill. <laughs> and our opponent scoops it up. They must not like kittens. Oh, and it was even the combo kill. Uh, yeah, let's keep it like that. That seemed to work. Uh, alright. I mean, we don't have the kill, but we have negates and transgress, which is good. Evolving Wilds, go. Mountain for our opponent. And take inventory. Well, let's crack Evolving Wilds, get an island. And swamp to transgress the mine. Collective Defiance, Bedlam Reveler. Now let's just take Reveler. Pass the turn. That's the one thing we can't really negate. Swamp, or er, island for our opponent. And there's the Thermo Alchemist. Well, they're going to be burning us. Let's just mount in and read the bones. Both lands to the bottom. All right, there's a pack. That's good. Opponent pings us down to 17. Plays a land. And pieces of the puzzle. Gets nothing. Whew, that's painful. Well, Sunken Hollow and get down our demonic pack. Pass the turn pings us down to 15. We might actually be getting there. All right, Collective Defiance. Oh, we're going to discard our hand? Okay. That's actually not horrible, I don't think. We will see. Let's uh kill this Thermo Alchemist. Opponent's going to ping us. We draw a negate? Hmm. This is a little sketchy if we don't find answers. Play another demonic pack. Play Evolving Wilds. Pass the turn. We are going to need to answer our own pact, or find a Harmless Offering. We do get to draw a bunch of cards, which should help. Incendiary Flow down to 12, down to 9. While our opponent's just trying to kill us, we get an Island. Alright, come on, give us some love, Demonic Pack. Let's draw two. Come on, Harmless Offering. And... I guess we might as well just draw again. I don't think we can die from here. So we draw four. There's Harmless Offering! Oh my god! I think that means we get the combo kill again. I think we got it! Uh, so... Sunken Hollow, and part the Water Veil. Then we discard a Dark Petition. We choose target opponent discards two cards, and four damage. So our opponent's empty-handed. Oh, they had a negate, too. And then we just... Harmless Offering. Give our opponent our demonic pack and play the blighted fen and pass the turn and we got there <laughs> yes part the water veil harmless offering demonic pact <laughs> together at last oh combo that's a combo <laughs> sweet all right against the odds playing some harmless pack in standard now oh, let's mulligan <laughs> All right, well, uh, we'll put part the water veil to the bottom for time being. Evolving Wilds, go. Lumbering Falls for our opponent. Well, let's crack Evolving Wilds, get an island. Uh, okay. <laughs> Apparently we just shuffled that part the water veil right back to the top. Play the Jays, pass the turn. Evolving Wilds for our opponent. Uh, let's loot with Jays. Discard a... Smoldering Marsh. Why, uh, Evolving Wilds go. We're getting sorta close to flipping a Jace. Forest for our opponent. There's the planes. Are we going to get Reflector Maged? Apparently not yet. Well, Crack Evolving Wilds. Mountain, I guess, is fine. Another Smoldering Marsh. Um, alright, let's loot with Jace. Discard a... Island. Play Wandering Fumeral, pass the turn. Opponent has... Just runs out the spell queller. Alright. Prairie stream. Opponent gets in for two. Down to 18. And passes. We get summary dismissal, which is good. Well, let's loot with Jace. Ugh. 
<laughs> I think we gotta let it go. Hope they whiff on Reflector Mage and then just languish. Oh, of course. Well, there's the Reflector Mage. We st do still get to loot. Scarred Evolving Wilds. Play Smoldering Marsh and then just languish. And pass the turn. Tireless Tracker for our opponent. And a land. Well, let's play the Swamp, play the Jace, and pass the turn. Leave up a Summary Dismissal. Summary Dismissal is kind of sweet. Like, we could have countered that card draw. Opponent gets another Prairie Stream, gets another clue. Dramoka's Command. Well, I think we got to counter this, or try to. Summary Dismissal. Our opponent's going to Collected Company in response. Sylvan Advocate. And another Reflector Mage. Of course. They never whiff on that Reflector Mage. Well, we stopped Dramoka's Command. Well, Hedron Crawler, Wandering Fumeral, pass the turn. Another land for our opponent. Swings with everything. We take a million. Down to four. Opponent passes. All right, let's play the Jays and pass the turn. We are probably still just dead here. Opponent cracks a clue, draws a card. All right, let's kill Tireless Tracker. <laughs> okay. Well then. Languishes, Grasp of Darkness. Go down a couple Hedron Crawlers and a Part the Water Veil. Try it like that. Well, we got a lot of the stuff we want. Uh, Evolving Wilds, goo. Our mana is a little questionable, forecasting everything. Planes for our opponent. All right, let's crack Evolving Wilds. Just get a Swamp for now. Swamp and Hedron Crawler. Pass the turn. There's a Duskwatch. Let's Grasp of Darkness to Duskwatch. Evolving Wilds, pass the turn. There's a blue mana. And Tireless Tracker. Well... I guess the question is going to be, does our opponent have a Dramoka's Command? Because we are going to slam a Demonic Pact, pass the turn. Alright, plays the land, gets a clue, self a spirit, and opponent gets in for three. Alright, let's, let's draw two cards here. Uh, read the bones, opponent sacks the clue. We are going to bottom both of those. Jeez, we did not hit an untapped mana. Alright, pass the turn. That was not great. Valving Wild's gonna get our opponent some more clues. Cracks it. We are very short on blue mana. Gets a clue. Opponent. Tags with both. We take six. And passes. Well, let's shoot at the tireless tracker. Cracks a clue. And cracks a clue. That's fine. We still gain a bunch of life. Up to 13. Well, this is not ideal by any means. But I think we just gotta languish. And pass the turn. There's a Tireless Tracker, and a land. Opponent cracks it. Uh, we might be getting there somehow. <laughs> Target opponent discards two cards. We draw an island. We... <laughs> Give our opponent the Demonic Pack. Pass the turn. Do you have Dramoka's Command? No, you lose the game. They can't even do it. <laughs> They're going to kill it, but the trigger's still on the stack. Oh, they're going to Collected Company. They're... What are you going to hit? A Stifle? <laughs> Sweet! We actually did it. Our opponent gets a bunch of power and toughness. It's just, it's not relevant. <laughs> oh, so good. They even had Dramoka's Command in hand. Oh, Lord. Sweet! Well, we, we got to win. And maybe we need negates too to protect our combo. Go down. Summary dismissals in this matchup are just so expensive. And try it like that. Well, I guess we got a painful truce. That's sort of something. Planes for our opponent. Um, so wandering fumeral go. Sylvan advocate. Evolving wilds ship the turn. Tap land for our opponent. And Sylvan advocate. Oh dear. We're gonna need this language to resolve. Opponent gets in for two. We crack Evolving Wilds, we get a Mountain, Swamp, and Painful Truce, X3. Pass the turn, discard Jace, and Blighted Fen. Opponent gets in with both. Alright, Choked Estuary, reveal a Swamp, and Demonic Pack. There's the Spell Queller. Well, it's going to be all about this language next turn. 
If it resolves, we should win. If they have another Spell Queller or a Negate, then we lose. <laughs> another Demonic Pack Swamp. And... And I mean, we might not even win, honestly. Uh, Languish. And opponent has Negate. That does it. Well, we got a game off Bant Company. Alright. Against the odds time, playing some Harmless Pack in Standard. If we draw a Black Source, we have turn 3 Demonic Pack. And then we just hope we find blue mana. Oh lord. Humans. 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 We might be a bit slow. Oh, a Jace that we can't cast. Alright, pass turn. Uh, yeah. Now I'm thinking maybe we should have mauled. If this was one of the slower decks, I think we'd be more okay, but this deck just puts us under so much pressure. Opponent gets in 4-1 with Inspector. Down to 19. Alright, I mean, we drew the Swamp. Hedron Crawler, go. Uh, so we might have some chance. Planes for our opponent. And always watching. Ugh, so we're taking five. But we do get a demonic pack down. So we're down to 14. Ooh, and Obnixilis. Well, let's demonic pack. Pass the turn. Ooh, Thalia's Lieutenant pumps up the dorks. So we take seven. Oh man, I hope we draw land. If we draw an untapped land and can play Obnixilis to kill something else, we might be okay. All right, well, I think we have to shoot down this knight. Oh, and it's a tap land. It is a blue land, though. All right, Wandering Fumeral, go. Cracks the clue. Second always watching. And another Thalia's Lieutenant. All right, this is it. This is going to be very close. We're taking 10 down to 1. So what we need to do is draw 2. We need to hit... Untapped Blue Source and Harmless Offering. We get Untapped Blue Source, but no Harmless Offering. So, part the Water Veil. Take an extra turn. Come on, Harmless Offering! Off the top, one time for the win. Come on. Oh, another Demonic Bat. Oh, we'll play it out. We, we can play a Jace, pass the turn, but we are, we are just dead. We in summary dismissal to stay alive, but it doesn't really matter. Anointer of Champions. All right, let's scoop it up. We'd have to block, block. Summary dismissal would tap us out just to not die to our pack, and then we would lose. Well, we get Languishes. Those are good. We get Grasp of Darkness. We go down. Obnixilis. Probably a Dark Petition. Painful Truce. And a Part the Water Veil. And try it like that. All right, we need to play first, which is good. Uh, all right, we'll try it. We have a lot of what we want. Uh, so, Wandering Fumeral, go. Untap land would be insane for this Jace. Planes and Kytheon. Duncan Hollow, go. Opponent gets in 4-2 with Kytheon. Down to 18. And Handwear Militia Captain. Well, let's Jace, tap land, pass the turn. The Raven Inspector gets a clue. Oh no. And Thalia's Lieutenant. Well, we are untapped land or bust. So we have like seven untapped lands. Take our beats down to 12. Demonic Pact. All right, loot with Jace. Oh, <laughs> oh it's Evolving Wilds. Punished. If we had an untapped land and could have languished there, we probably win or at least have a decent chance we have the entire combo all right against the odds playing some harmless pack in standard and i think we keep this it's got some things going for it forest for our opponent we get a evolving wilds pestern sylvan advocate for our opponent oh crack evolving wilds get a island swamp and go forest for our opponent and another sylvan advocate Gets in 4-2. What's Sunken Hollow? Do we just pass? Yeah, let's play Oath of Jace. We don't want to get blown out by Dramoka's Command. Ooh, and Apart the Water Veil. Well, I guess we discard Wandering Fumeral and Obnixilis. Pass the turn. See what our opponent has. Retreat to Kazandu. Huh. Alright, hits us for 4. No Scry. Um, yeah, let's just swamp and run out Demonic Pack. Pass the turn. Well, we're pretty close to getting the combo kill. 
If we can survive our next turn, opponent has hanger back, X1. All right, that's fine. Opponent gets in, 4-4, four, four, down to 10. Uh, no scry, let's just shoot down hanger back. Opponent gets a thopter, and we got the land. All right, we, <laughs> we got there. All right, so languish, wipe away our opponent's board. Pass the turn, and we got the part the water veil, so unless our opponent can kill us or our pack this turn, we should just win next turn. Well, take two turns in a row and win. Opponent passes. Oh, poor opponent. All right, so let's make our opponent discard a couple cards. Uh, Gideon and Tragic Arrogance. Whoo. All right, so now we just Smoldering Marsh and part the Water Veil. Go to our extra turn. Then we draw two cards. Hopefully hit a land so we can leave up a counter. All right, there's land. Play the land. <laughs> <laughs> offer our opponent a deal with the devil. They don't have a choice but to say yes. And pass the turn. <laughs> oh, I think we got him. Our opponent goes with Dromoka's command. But we have summary dismissal. Oh, they're just going to they're not going to do it. And <laughs> our opponent loses. All right. <laughs> I guess that was just the, the pump fake tap. Uh, well, that went pretty good against green-white tokens. I think we want negates, and we do not want probably... Uh, we definitely want languishes as well, I think. Uh, go down hedron crawlers. Go down a summary dismissal, a dark petition, and a jace, and try it like that. Oh, uh, all right. This hand's fine-ish. Hopefully our language is good. Fortified Village. Untapped. And Oath of Nyssa for our opponent. They get a forest. Passes a turn. We Evolving Wilds go. Forest for our opponent. Hanger back X1. Alright, Crack Evolving Wilds. Get a island. Ooh, I kind of want a Jace. Alright, let's run the Jace out there. Pass the turn. Forest for our opponent. And Nyssa. Little annoying. Makes a token. Opponent passes. Well, Evolving Wilds pass the turn. Canopy Vista. And Sylvan Advocate. Oh, uh, we probably are going to have to languish at some point. Counters up the creatures. Some point soon. Opponent passes. Well, we get to loot with Jace. Discard a. I guess just a land. Crack Evolving Wilds, get a Swamp, and then we'll Sunken Hollow, pass the turn, puts a counter on the hanger back, see if they cash in their Nyssa. Alright, Gideon, let's negate the Gideon. Alright, ticks down, I think this is actually fine, goes attacking, so let's block with Jace. Loot with Jace. Discard an island. Flip Jace. Take two. Down to 18. And then we will disperse hanger back. Ooh, and apart the water veil. Whoo, what's the plan now? Yeah, let's take down Jace on disperse. Disperse the Sylvan Advocate. Smoldering Marsh and pass the turn. So we are going to lose our Jace, but hopefully that's okay. Sylvan Advocate and Hanger Back. Opponent gets in, kills our Jace. Well, that was a risky line, but it worked out because our opponent did not have their sixth land. So we actually managed to get in a position where we get to languish everything. They get a token. Whoo, that <laughs> was pretty fortunate. Pass the turn. Opponent has another Sylvan Advocate. Gets in 4-1. We draw a Demonic Pack. Well, let's Dark Petition. Get Obnixilis. Island. Play Obnixilis. Kill Sylvan Advocate. Pass the turn. And then if our opponent uses Dromoka's command to kill our Obnixilis with a counter, what is happening? They have something with Flash? 
Oh, secure. All right, that's secure the waste. That's kind of bad. We we're trying to get the Dromoka's command out of their hand for our demonic pack. And another Sylvan Advocate. So many Sylvan Advocates. Kills our Obnixilis. Hits us for one. Down to 16. Uh, that was actually a pretty good draw. So let's demonic pack. Pass the turn. This might be enough. We're going to need a bit of luck, but it might be good enough. There's the six land. Pumps up the Sylvan Advocate. So we're taking seven here. Down to nine. Opponent passes. Let's make our opponent discard their last two cards. Well, let's see if we can draw a Harmless Offering. Take an extra turn with Part the Water Veil. Opponent had two removal spells. Oh, come on, Harmless Offering. We need to draw two cards. If we draw Harmless Offering, yes, we got there. <laughs> oh, combo, comboing off again. Another part the water veil. Oh my god. <laughs> Play Evolving Wilds. Oh, now we'll deal four damage to something. Doesn't really matter because we get to give our opponent Demonic Pact. <laughs> oh, that was the best one. So good. Two part the water veils into drawing the Harmless Offering into... Oh my god. <laughs> yes! Oh, that was so sweet. <laughs> so what do we learn this week about Harmless Pact? Uh, so, first off, the combo is very game-winning. We got a lot of opponents with the actual combo. It does have the problems we knew it had, where it's kind of slow, you gotta play the pact, wait a whole turn for anything to happen, then kind of wait three more turns, to actually win the game or two more turns after that uh that said the idea of using part the water veil as basically a way to get an extra upkeep to choose an extra option with demonic pack to speed up the process actually worked really well so that was pretty pretty sweet and i'm really happy with how that part of the deck turned out overall we won six out of 15 matches which is fine Overall, we won 6 out of 15 games, which is fine, about eh, mid-30% range. We won 2 matches, and we struggled against decks you think we'd struggle with. Decks that could put on some pressure and disrupt us with things like Dromoka's Command and Spell Queller, or we're just all-out aggro. That's kind of one of the weaknesses of our build, which is kind of combo-centric. We have lots of tutors, we have the Part the Water Veils to combo off and make the kill more efficient, but because of that, we give up some of the removal and so forth, so uh, we're not really the control deck that just happens to win with Harmless Offering and Demonic Pact. We're more of a combo deck built around those cards, so we we gave up something in those aggressive matchups where we could have just played the grindy, like, blue-black control game and eventually tried to win with Harmless Offering Demonic Pact as our win condition, but I, I like how it turned out, and I'm pretty happy with it. So it was fun to play, we got some wins, we won some matches, and we got the combo kills a couple of times. I mean, double part of the Water Veil to take two extra turns to choose two extra options into the Harmless Offering was pretty sweet. So I'm pretty happy with how it turned out, and I had a lot of fun playing it, so... Anyway, that's been our Against Odds for this week, Harmless Pact in Standard. Make sure to head over to the webpage. Uh, you can find a link in the description to vote for next week's Against the Odds deck, another Eldritch Moon edition. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will talk to you soon.